Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Mark Morley, Product Marketing Director at OpenText. In this video, I will discuss how our IoT platform can help to maximize the uptime of serviceable equipment or assets by monitoring for potential part failures and then deciding whether to repair or replace a failing part. To leverage predictive maintenance across serviceable equipment, our IoT platform has a number of key capabilities. Firstly, it can securely provision connected devices to prevent unauthorized access to sensor information. We can connect IoT devices using industry standard communication protocols such as MQTT. We can retrieve information from a range of standard sensors such as GPS, strain and fluid flow sensors. Our embedded analytics environment can be used to monitor individual part or subsystem performance. Our IoT environment can be seamlessly integrated to back-end business systems such as enterprise resource planning or warehouse management systems. Finally, to leverage AI and machine learning to analyze historical sensor information to determine likely failure of a component and then decide whether a component or subsystem should be repaired or replaced. In this scenario, we have a connected vehicle shown in the center of the screen and we will be leveraging predictive maintenance to detect an emerging problem and decide what action will be taken to alleviate the problem. Fluid flow sensors have detected a drop in water pressure across the cooling pump. This sensor information is sent via a telematics link to the IoT platform where service technicians have been notified in a local service center. The service technicians need to decide whether a part should be repaired or replaced. So the service technicians connect to Cloud Motors HQ, which then gives them access to Cloud Motors Enterprise Cloud and onto their AI and machine learning environment. In addition to monitoring all sensor information from the vehicle, the AI platform can aggregate information such as cooling pump running hours, driving conditions, historical pump failure rates, and cooling pump maintenance schedules related to a specific vehicle or group of vehicles, to then make a recommendation of whether to repair or replace the failing cooling pump. If the AI platform recommends to repair the cooling pump, then the service technicians will need secure access to this design information relating to the vehicle, effectively a digital twin of the vehicle. To achieve this, the service technician securely logs into the content management platform via our identity and access management solution. They can search for the digital information relating to the cooling pump and they can either download to a local 3D printer to construct a replacement part or they can download information such as 3D drawings, disassembly videos or repair instructions to a ruggedized tablet or mobile device that can be used in the service bay. If the AI platform recommends replacing the cooling pump, then this can be ordered through our cloud business network. All suppliers of the parts to the vehicle are connected to this network. The service technician securely logs into the parts ordering portal, searches for the part, and an order is then placed with the part supplier, and this will then be dispatched via a third party logistics carrier to the service center location. The service center then contacts the driver to let them know that in about a thousand miles time, the cooling pump on their vehicle is likely to fail but not to worry as they can in this case replace the pump and a new part has been ordered their car has already been booked into the service center to have it replaced by helping to keep the driver's vehicle on the road they have significantly improved customer satisfaction levels and the driver is more likely to visit the dealership in the near future when they are looking to buy their next vehicle if you'd like more information on how our IoT platform can help to maximize the availability of serviceable equipment or assets, please visit opentext.com forward slash connected operations. Thanks for watching this video and goodbye.